What's happening, Night Riders? So, we have another Ruby fan made animation um, by Tommy Lau. What was the numbers at the end? Tommy Lau 74. There we go. Um, this one is entitled Ruby 30 Days Angel. Um, the previous one that we did, well, the previous one that I reacted to, um, Damn it, what was the name of that? Um, fuck, I'm drawing a blank, drawing a blank. Lee, there we go. Um, the last one that, that I reacted to entitled Lee was actually really fucking good. Um, like pretty much on par of how Ruby was maybe for volume one. I'll compare it to the animation of volume one. So it was actually really, really good. So now this one, I'm super, super excited to check out because this is the more recent one. Um, how long ago did this one come out? This one came out a month ago. So the previous one I did, Lee, Lee came out about a year ago. This one came out about a month ago. So I'm guessing that he only has gotten better at his animation. So without any further ado, let's just jump straight into this and let's get introduced to Angel. Let's go, y'all. Forget me not. Ruby, 30 days. All right, Tommy Lau, 74. You guys are not subscribed to him? You need to be, because this animation is awesome. Caged bird. Ah, so this one is fighting Weiss. So maybe each one he comes out with is going to fight a member of Team Ruby. Because Lee fought Ruby, and now Angel is fighting Weiss. Okay. I like that close-up. She's walking... She's using it as like a blind stick. Is she blind? And this is Weiss's song from the White Trailer. I like that he's doing this, to be honest with you. Oh, she's blind. Oh, shit. Oh shit! What? She trapped in a cage? That's sick! That is sick. Oh, she blocked each one? That animation is sick. Oh! Cool. Weiss got her though. Weiss got her. Oh shit, her aura is depleted? Is that what just happened? The fuck was that? What the fuck is that? What the fuck just happened? And she healed? That shit is sick. This shit is sick. Yeah. Why is this a dance and a singer? So. This makes so much sense. I, I really like this trailer. And this is all, like, he sat there and created all this shit. This is fucking crazy. Oh! The fuck ha-
Oh, is that back when she was able to see? Is that shit like feeding on Weiss's negative emotions? What the fuck? What? What? Bruh. What? The actual fuck? Yo, okay. Um, Mr. Tommy Lau? <laughs> Yo. That shit is crazy, so... Weiss got infected with the, with that, with the black markings. And... I won't say that it, it looks like it made her crazy, but it, it just looks like it feeds off her negative emotions. To where... She's willing to kill. Because when she was fighting Angel, you could tell that Weiss was ready. Like, she just had this crazy, sadistic look in her face like she wanted to kill her. Same thing when she just saw Ruby. So, what the fuck? Um, yeah. Okay, wait, hold on. Let me get these initials right. It's, uh, let's go back. Where is it? Go back, go back. There we go. So K C A L. So we got the L and we got the A. So we got Lee and we got Angel. The next one, it seems as though that we're going to be getting is C. And then the last one is K. I do find that it's very interesting that he's going backwards. Instead of releasing K, then C, then A, then L. Kind of like how Ruby did it, he's going the opposite. So I like that that's different. Um, I think Angel was probably the crazier one out of the, the Angel and Lee trailers. I think Angel's was, was the craziest one. Um, I can't wait to see, like, what what character he creates for C, and I can't wait to see what character he creates for K. Um, my guess is is that C is probably going to be mashed up with Blake, and K is probably going to be mashed up with Yang. Um, this is crazy. This this is crazy. This I honestly hope that he keeps this going because I am so unbelievably fucking intrigued that. If he sat down and created his own show, um, I would watch it. I would seriously watch it. Um, maybe it's being pronounced Kale? Kal? Kale? I don't know. But, um, because you know how RWBY is, is, you know, pronounced as Ruby. You know, you got Team Ruby, Coffee, shit like that. So I think this one is probably Kale? Kal? Kale? I don't know. But, um, 
Yeah, if he had the time to sit there and like create a show out of this, I don't know if he's gonna do that, but I'm just saying if he did, I swear I would sit down and react to it the way that I do Rooster Teeth's Ruby. You know what I mean? Um, Rooster Teeth need to hire him, probably have these characters come in, come in on Ruby in like future volumes. That shit is crazy. That shit is crazy. Like this, I would put this fan animation on the same par as, um, fuck, what was the name of that other? There was another Ruby fan made animation. Fuck, who was it? The guy Mark, um, Silver. I would put them on the same par. Um, I'm still waiting for Mark to release another one, but I do understand that these animations take a lot of time, especially if you're doing it by yourself. I understand it takes a lot of time, um, but I cannot fucking wait. I really, really can't fucking wait. I definitely put them on the same level as as the as the silver fan made trailers. I would put them on that same level because this shit is sick. Anyway, I'm rambling. I truly, truly enjoyed this Night Riders. Post your comments down below and let me know what you thought about Ruby 30 Days Entitled Angel. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. I truly enjoyed this. Um, definitely show your love and support to uh, Tommy Lyle 74 Click the link down below in the description box and it'll take you directly to the video that we just finished watching. From there, you will be able to subscribe to his channel. Give him a thumbs up the whole nine. This was awesome, and I can't wait for him to do the next one. <laughs> I really, really can't. So, until next time, and I write this. Try to die, y'all. We out.